My name is Sherry Williams and I am a member of Living Word Baptist Church. I was invited by Sister Vanessa, uh, Vanessa Fletcher, who is our First Lady from Living Word Baptist Church. Um, she had given me a call and asked me if I would be interested in working with her. And I'm like, you know, I'm all about the young adults. And then after that, I received my invitation to go to the uh, conference. So we spent a lot of time in the beginning trying to gather the information from the young adults themselves. I mean, we hear so much about what we want them to do. Well, we want to hear from them what they want to do. And we kind of just started building off of that by creating um, not only different uh, events for them to um, come to, to fellowship, to, to understand that they're, they're not alone um, and that they, get, they have others that they can talk to about things. What I would like for you to know about the about New Revelations as a whole is that we are an authentic place and a, a place, a safe haven where anyone, not just young adults, to be quite honest, uh, anyone can come and feel safe in thinking the way they think, looking the way they look, and just being them. We always hear that, you know, uh, children are our future. The children are our future. Well, our, our future is now. And reaching them and being able to engage with our young adults is key in the survival of our future. And um, yeah, so I, I just want everybody to know that we're open. We, we take them all. <laughs> and uh, everyone is welcome. I'm Pastor Jimmy Ellison. I'm the pastor of New Revelation um, Church. I've been pastoring through uh, with New Revelation since June of 2021. Center for Congregations has allowed us the, the chance to be able to reach. I can't sit up here and say that um, we would have even taken on this opportunity if we hadn't been exposed to it. And so we're given this opportunity to not look at ourselves as the beneficiary, but to spread the message honestly and openly and be about reaching the people that we've been in the community we've been placed in. So at this point in time, the programming that New Revelation is doing to capture is we're one offering an opportunity for a different, a non-traditional style of service. We <laughs> honestly don't have a, a schedule of events. We know that the function of worship is way more important than the forms of worship. And so we come in ready to have the functions, an opportunity to worship, an opportunity to praise, get the message. And the added thing is create discussion. We want to show the relevancy because that's what the world is attacking, the relevancy of the Word of God, that it doesn't, they're trying to make it not fit, but God's Word fits. Our issue is that we're not offering opportunity for that discussion so people can see. Because right now we're in an age and dealing with the young adults population that you can't just tell them if you're not going to give them opportunity to really process it. And they process out loud. So we give the opportunity to process out loud. So our, how, we, how, our, how we facilitate those programming is we have our Saturday service. We um, meet at 11 a.m. on the second and fourth Saturday of every month. We then on the first and third Wednesdays of every month, we do have small group study. And in that study, we talk about topics and we tie in the Word of God. Like this month, we were talking about music and connecting how we listen to music, not just the music we listen to and then we um that filters into our, our podcast of is it just me uh, and woman to woman podcast that all all those things work together to really continue to meet the needs of all the the souls and the the people that we engage with